I think it's right for me because it's a small school. I like small schools. I come from a very small town. There's only like 400 people in it. Everybody knows everybody, and that's what I like about Lakeshore. I have classmates who are 20 plus years older than me, but I can relate to them in the sense that we're all in this together. It's a very strong sense of community. She inspired me to go to nursing school as well because she went to nursing school before she dropped out and, you know, got married and had kids. I was doing like event planning in the sales department. So then obviously when COVID hit, we couldn't be doing customer training trips and things like that. So then I started working from home. Everybody was doing some downsizing and stuff. So then I lost my job. When she was like, you know what, I'm going to sign up at LTC and let's go through the nursing program. I was like, okay, like sounds cool. I'm like, why not? You know, so yeah, so then I, you know, started doing like content at LTC and, you know, got my transcripts in order and see what I needed to do and yeah, just kind of went from there. When I hear people be like, you're going to college with your mom, I'm like, well, yeah, like you don't? And it's, it's, to me, it's like, well, of course I do. I was coming to LTC a couple days a week for school and you know, like I was having some of the same instructors that she just had. I was very low key on the whole idea. Like, like I didn't come right up to him and be like, oh, hey, I'm Olivia's mom, yeah. At my age now, you realize how fast two and a half years can go, you know. And an 18 year old or 19 year old feels like forever, right? I like to always say separate, but together, you know. Yes, we're going to college together, but we're actually not together. I mean, I see my mom maybe once a day because, you know, she's living her life, I'm living my life. We happen to live together right now and we happen to be going to the same school. Even if it's just like we're at home and I'm upstairs in the, in the dining room setting and she's down in her room studying or doing homework, it's like we're still kind of both home at the same time. So we'll take breaks and be like, okay, what do you want for lunch? And we'll make lunch or something like that. Or it'll be like, I have to run to Walmart to get some groceries and she'll be like, oh, I need a break, I'll come with you. Okay, you know, so it's like, you're like, spending a little bit of time together. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm sure she's looking forward to like moving out next year or something, but 